with the No. 31 pick in the 2019 NFL Draft, the Los Angeles Rams should have plenty of great prospects to consider, although one of the tough parts about picking this late in the first round is considering the best player available approach. After trading away their previous first-round picks in each of the last two years, it will be interesting to see if the Rams end up holding on to the selection this time around. If they do, another name worth keeping an eye on for Los Angeles if he happens to slip late in the first round could be Clemson's Dexter Lawrence, especially if they want to help fill the void left by Endomic and Sue on defense. Want your voice heard? Join the Ramblin' fan team. Right for us. Last offseason, the Rams were able to convince Sue to come on board for a one-year deal since they were in a win-now mode for the Super Bowl, and the veteran seemed like he could be a missing piece to the defense. Plus, the thought alone of Sue teaming up with Aaron Donald on the defensive line seemed to have all sorts of potential for Wade Phillips and company. While there were some frustrations surrounding Sue's play from the regular season, he did step up big when Los Angeles needed him to in the playoffs. But from a financial perspective, the Rams realized right away that Sue's asking price would most likely be out of their range this offseason, and when looking at some of the other areas they needed to address, this really wasn't that big of a surprise. Lovely for Los Angeles, the draft is the perfect opportunity to potentially find a replacement for Sue, and Lawrence's time with the Tigers makes him seem like a great candidate that could help keep the Rams' defense in great shape for another run at the Super Bowl. Between his athletic ability or simply the quickness he brings to the table, it's only a matter of time before Lawrence finds success at the NFL level. Next, 15 best free agent acquisitions all time for Rams whether the Rams happen to be the Team Lawrence receives an opportunity from only time will tell for the NFC champions, but here's to hoping they will at least have the defensive tackle on the radar since that void left by Sue isn't going to fill itself this offseason.